Right then, hello again. I'm on another session at Newton Park today. Uh, I've had three sessions since my last video. The um, first one was a 24 hour session on Little Hayes Tobber Manor with Luke Nix from Bath Angling. Uh, we had seven fish each, biggest was about a £16 common. So uh, I'll put some photos in after this intro of that, uh, of some of the fish that we both had. So that was a decent overnight session. And then I had a session down here last Tuesday. I had four fish to £13, uh, but I forgot my camera. And last Thursday I had a session down Sentry Ponds, um, as some of you may have seen on my Facebook. Uh, I took my girlfriend down again, I had a really nice common, I'll put a picture of that in as well, uh, 1611. So uh, yeah, let's get on with the session, my phone's ringing so I better answer that, Jack Carly. So uh, yeah, let's um, see what we can have some today. Right, here we go, second night I've ever done, uh, down on the little haze at Tober Manor, here with Luke. Quarter past ten, it's all went off, nearly fell over there. <laughs> Um, I'm going to have to take the sling off in the morning when it's dried because it's a new sling, I don't know how much it weighs. But uh, yeah, I've just done some pictures, so I'm going to quickly show you the other one. Just to be still. So you have one nice mirror this time. This one's just into doubles, I think. I think the other one's around £13. But uh, yeah, weigh the sling and all that in the morning. And, uh, and then I'll tell you the weights of them, but yeah, cracking start to the night, hopefully sign of things to come. And uh, Luke will have a couple and we'll have a good night. Let's get these two back. All right then guys, back nine o'clock now, and uh, just as I was sort of saying to Jake that I'm not really too sure what's gonna happen, the receiver went in my pocket, and uh, there's this nice little mirror. And I've got to say, I'm taking quite a like, really nice looking fish, to be honest. Quite a nice clean, Clean mirror carp, so nice fish, mate. Well then, just about the biggest of the session, we think. We're still not sure of the size of the common that I had exactly, but this one's gone 15 on the dot, so just about edged it, I think. So I'm gonna have to get one more. Right then, fish number three for me. Uh, he's not very big, this one. About half nine now, I think. Just sat in Luke's bivy. He had this fish not long ago, and I just had a screamer out of the blue, and uh, resulted in this little one. Lovely proud fish, but this thing up as you can see. Lovely scale pattern on it. But just got some pictures, so I was It's 9 o'clock this morning, it's probably about half one, two-ish now. I'm not quite sure of the time, I fell asleep for a bit. But um, yeah, this one's absolutely rattled off. And 15-6, uh, so I've just pit looped to the biggest fish of the day so far. But uh, still got a couple of hours left, so we can still bag a bigger one. But uh, yeah, really, really happy with this one, absolutely pristine condition. These are the fish. Really chuffed with this one. 
done some pictures. Yeah, let's get back where it belongs. Here she is. 16 pound 4 ounces. Topper man and little haze. What a great session it actually turned out to be. I'll get some snaps in this one. The two latest fish that you saw were the biggest two from that particular session, a very enjoyable 24 hour session at Little Haze with Luke. The following fish you will see is a couple of stockies I caught from Newton Park on the surface in my latest session and a photo at the end of a 15.6 that I had when the camera was already packed away. Right then, first fish of the day, going to get them packed quick. Little mirror, lovely scales on it, they ain't grown much so this is the sort of size that they stocked them at. But, uh... Yeah, cracking little fish, about three, four pound off the surface. There you go, putting his fin up for you. He's really wriggly on the mat. So, uh, yeah, there we go. Caught off the surface. Let's get him back, hopefully, get some more today. Right then, there we go, fish number two. Caught off the surface again. It's another small little stocky. This one's a little bit bigger, maybe pushing five pound. But, uh, yeah, there's definitely some bigger fish in the swim. I saw a really nice mirror cruising around in the margins. Looked at least upper double. But uh, he wasn't really interested. But uh, yeah, there's definitely some bigger fish cruising around in the swim. So um, that's always a good sign. But yeah, lovely little stocky. Lovely scales again on it. They all, they're all really pretty in here. But uh, yeah, thanks, mate. But uh, you going to get some a bit bigger, please? Alright, let's get him back. Alright, then I'll be quick. It is a different fish. Third stocky. He's tensing up. He's probably about the middle sized of them all. They've all been about. <laughs> Well, below five pound, but uh, yeah, I'm adamant there's some bigger fish in the swim, so uh, get this one on back. This one was about literally two minutes after I put the other one back, so uh, yeah, hopefully it's kicking off a little bit now, and uh, hopefully we'll have a couple of bigger ones. Right then, getting another stocky, not going to keep them out long. Another pretty one, absolutely tiny again, though. I've never caught fish this small all in the same day. Four in one day, it's ridiculous, but yeah. Let's get him back. Praying there's something a bit bigger out there. Alright, then, oh, fish number five in the mat. It's a wriggly. And there's another stocky. I'm going to stop showing them now. If I get another one, I'm going to slip it straight back. They're nice to look at, but uh, yeah, I'm going to concentrate on getting something a bit bigger now. So, hopefully, that's the last you'll see of the stockies. And uh, next time, it'll be a nice old, big original, hopefully. Right then, it's literally right at the end, camera's packed away, but Luke's here, so he's going to send me over the footage. But this nice original, finally, after five stock is. Not sure of the weight. What do you reckon, Luke? Oh, yeah, right. Decent one. He's yeah, a bit of whip to him. Probably like 15-ish. Yeah, about 15 mark. Four